Well, good morning, sir. I'd like to welcome you to Fleet Week here in the Los Angeles port. We're very excited to have all the different uh, soldiers and sailors, Marines, the, all the military here. We're very excited. So would you mind just introducing yourself, uh, your rank, and what you do, and then we can talk a little more. Thank you. Uh, I'm Staff Sergeant Dale Roulette. I'm an explosive ordnance disposal technician out of First EOD Company, Camp Pendleton, California. Oh, that's very awesome. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about your job, what you do, a little more specifically, uh, what your specialty entails? Yes, so mostly we uh, handle explosive hazards, anything from conventional ordnance to improvised explosive devices, along with uh, chemi chemical and bio biological threats. Um, we run the whole gamut along that. There's, there's a very, um, sorry, very intricate job. There's a lot, a lot of different things we do. Sure, and how long have you been in, in the job that you're in now? Uh, eight years. Oh wow, okay, so you are one of the more experienced Marines out there. That's and, correct, uh, sir. <laughs> uh, I just really appreciate you doing I'll tell that to you on behalf of our audience, too. Uh, it's very much appreciated, your, your service and the, your particular specialty. And Thank you. It's very much appreciated. So, so are you excited about Fleet Week? You're here in the port of Los Angeles, in San Pedro. And sounds like you've been out a little bit and already kind of exploring around, having some fun. Uh, what are you looking forward to in the next few days here at Fleet uh, Week? Just seeing more of, the, more of this town. San Pedro is a beautiful town. Everyone's been very welcoming and gracious. Uh, been very much enjoying it. So are you looking forward to uh, being here on the expo site and talking to people, sharing with them your specialty and your passion Absolutely. for the military and what you do? Absolutely. It's fun getting to uh, increase awareness about our MOS because not a lot of people know what our job is and what we do. Um, so both uh, increasing awareness among the public as well as among fellow Marines who we might be trying to get to lap move into our job. Uh, very good. Are you, uh, is it kind of in a way recruiting here too? Is it sort yes. of what your mission might be as part of what you're doing here is to recruit people into Partially. the Marines? Uh, not necessarily into the Marine Corps overall, but into our job. Um, mm -hmm. I mean, definitely at overall everybody's here as part of a recruiting effort and community relations, um, fostering relations between the military and the community at large. Yeah, and with, with what you do with EOD, what type of thing do you see that that prepares you for once you're out of the Marines? Is, that, uh, is there a particular kind of job that you would think of going into? or Probably or, not, to be honest. I yeah. enjoy the job, but once I'm, once I'm out, I'm uh, probably going to go a different direction with my life. Um, but a lot of outside-the-box thinking is required for our job and different thought processes that will lend itself well to the civilian world. Well, I, I can tell you, I think with your training and your personality and getting to meet you now, you're not going to have any problem out there finding something to do regardless of the field. I, you, I think military experience is very valued uh, by employers, and, and I think whatever you choose to do will be great. So I hope you have a wonderful time here at the, for the rest of Fleet Week. Do you have any shout-outs in particular you'd like to give or no family locally? Some people have family yeah, to visit locally or anything, nothing like that. Okay. Well, I really appreciate your time, and I really appreciate your service, sir. Appreciate the support, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you.